Take the tuna fish, poke little holes in the top. The crawfish can't get to the bait, so that way they can't eat it all. The scent still comes out and it tracks them in. It's like taking a piece of chicken. If you use chicken, suspend it from the top of the trap. It's a fishing, a fishing line or 550 cord or something. But if you take this, put it in, the little slits pointed up. You can put it down in the, in the water. Oh, if you can get to it, take your 550 cord, tie it off somewhere so it holds the trap from floating away. And then you want to find an area that's got a lot of cover crawfish I mean they really have no no way of defending themselves except for just concealment so they like to hide under rocks or down foliage like this you got a lot of logs and trees and stuff there's a lot of uh, rocks down in the bottom too they'll, they'll hide underneath that but hopefully my goal is they're gonna smell the bait they're gonna come to the trap I mean I've caught them here before so I'm hoping I can catch them again if not whatever we got five traps we're gonna put out we got what, two in the water now this is three we have two more we're gonna go down river a little bit try to find more more areas like this and then uh, put them in see what happens I'm hoping to catch about four or five a trap I mean more is great less is not great so we'll see oh another thing is you want the trap as flat as you can get on the bottom that way it makes it easier for them to crawl in uh, if it's up off the bottom, they got to try to swim up into the bait. It don't always work for them. This one's set pretty good. We should uh, hopefully get a few in here, but we'll find out tomorrow. So do I. like walking on ice right here. Oh my god. Oh, I almost <laughs> just went in. <laughs> <laughs> I just went in. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, what a cold a, night. It is very cold. Yeah. That's all right. Dries up. <laughs> oh, God, I almost just did it again. I swear to God, it's just slipperier and ice. Well, I hope we catch a couple out of this. We ain't catching uh, nothing out of this one, I guarantee it. Caught some good footage. <laughs> There's number four. I've got a, got a little wet getting them. Actually, it's a little crooked. I'm going to try to... Already wet. What does it matter? Oh my god, this water's cold. Yeah, that looks like it's sitting pretty good right there. I'm gonna tie it off. All right. Same thing. We got oh, a little different. I'm wet. But we got uh, a bunch of down trees. It's a little faster moving water. It's not uh, not too bad. I got the trap sitting kind of flat. There's a lot of rocks. There's a lot of cover for them. We had a mink. We come by. There's a mink eating right here. So they like to eat crawfish. That's one sign. So we figure with rocks cover and a mink, there's got to be. I mean, they got to be in here somewhere. So okay, we got our tuna fish set traps in the water yeah, most we can do is come back tomorrow and see so we'll be back in about we'll give this probably be less than 24 hours probably about 20 hours it's a little late i'd like to come check them before it gets too dark i'd like to cook them but about 20 hours and we'll come back and check them
Well, we got one on the outside of the trap. We'll eat just the same. Put him in there. There might be another one in there. Grab him. I ain't touching that thing. I am not touching him. Nope. Not today. Look at them biters he's got, Mike. You make him punch and bite me, I will, I will shoot you, I swear to God. There's one in there. Side of the king. No. Minnow. No. You don't see him right there. I see him now. Oh. I don't think this one has pinchers. They don't get little pinchers. little ones. No, they don't. They've been ripped off. Poor guy got into a fight. Some ripped them off. They grow them back though. Couple minnows again. Mike has a zipper, ain't there? Yeah. That's, ooh, that's a good one. Yeah, he looks, he looks real angry. This little guy, I let go. Oh, this fish scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Let's take a look at him and beat him up. Yeah. Well, they're suckers. Are they? One's a sucker and the other one looks like, a, well, it's some sort of sucker. What do you mean to like it? We'll take pictures of them. God, I don't want to touch them. Oh, he smells so bad. Oh, it's so slimy, I can't even grab him. Dude, it's extremely slimy. Dude, quit! It's got tentacles, look at him. It's catfish. Is it? Yeah. Don't look like one. This is where Mike went in the water yesterday. <laughs> See if he can get the trap out without getting wet. I guarantee. Oh, we might not get anything in this one. Not a damn thing. Well, it got caught in the current. Tipped the trap so it wasn't sitting on the floor of the river oh well, they weren't able to crawl in there I'd like to think they tried but we got nothing can of tuna I guess we'll have to eat the tuna for supper still alright
What kind of fish are those? Supper. <laughs> what is that? Ugly. I just, I don't get. Maybe chicken's better. Good news is we caught the most on my set. <laughs> so, I win. Yeah, pretty weak supper. A couple of crawdads and five cans of river tuna. <laughs> Can you make us out of that, Mike? <laughs>